I'm sleeping, I'm eating. What's on this? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. This is why I'm gonna need a break. I'm tired right now. I gotta go to sleep. I ain't been asleep all night. Shit, trying to get y'all this music for free. Goodness gracious. Hold on. Oh yeah. <laughs> Hardcore hip hop. It's, it's um, 
it's uh it's feel good hip hop. It's feel good music. It's 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 really commercial sounding and that sounds really strange coming from a hip hop artist, but I like you to understand that all hip hop artists do commercial tracks. The thing about my music is is that my music is um lyrically content ready, heavy thick i lays it on thick um and it's catchy like it's catchy it's it's aggressive it's it's feminine it's 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 aggressive feminine you know and that's what i think is a winning formula for me i and just from sitting down listening to people taking notes I um, understand some things about my music and that's also why I had to go back and listen to like the evolution of Nov, like the evolution of my music and where it's like how it's um, you know sort of become what it is today and I mean it's very exciting it's tiring but it's very exciting because you know I love hip-hop I love the genre I love rap you know, I love a lot of different genres of music. You understand? And I just, I, I embrace it like it's part of me. Like it's part of my upbringing. And it's part of so much. And it just, it's not enough, it's not enough minutes in a day to explain it. You know, um, being a, being the only female in my household, other than my mom, like my brother's very competitive i'm very very competitive and i push myself i push myself so hard i had people i have people who are some of your favorite artists who are my friends growing up you know what i'm saying as a kid like growing up who they just pushed me they told me i suck nigga like it was not easy ozzy used to tell me i suck <laughs> he used to str and he needed to do that because that's what made me go stronger that's what made me go harder and now I never hear that that I suck you know and then of course um it's just been very good like I've had I just I I sound like I'm accepting an award I'm not accepting an award that's not what it is I'm just giving you a more insight into Novocaine the first as an artist Novocaine the first as the evolution things I have I didn't always pursue music I didn't give I didn't I didn't I didn't always put my music out there because I just I don't know I was selfish I did it for myself I guess but I'm dope I'm so dope and so you know it, it just, it's over with listen this set is going to be so dope it's going to be high energy as long as I can get some rest. And, um, you know, so I'm so excited. I haven't even brushed my teeth, washed my face. I literally have been up since 2 o'clock. You know, I don't really get much sleep. But um, music keeps me going. Music keeps me alive. Music keeps me here. You feel me? And, you know, words, they play such an integral part of my sanity. Like, the way words come together, I'm infatuated with them. And the way, like, rhythm and cadence sort of plays a part in, you know, inflection and colors and rhythm is just like, you know, with the message and, like, the, the cockiness and the aggressiveness and the energy and it's just really dope like and it's and i'm part of that and so that's so fucking dope to me that's so dope to me so i hope you guys come out tonight um i will be at scully's um i'm catching the bus i'm poor yeah i'm very poor very humble and poor <laughs> i might hitchhike my friends probably ain't gonna let me i'm probably not gonna tell them probably just get there i get there but um yeah i'm rocking out I got a lot of stuff to get off my chest. I'm at almost 10 minutes. Come to Scully's tonight if you're in Columbus, Ohio. Um, we have a lot of great artists performing tonight. Like, I'm about to pull up the bill real quick. I know uh, Keto and I, we got a cut. I know Big Chief is on there. Um, I think Jugga's going to be in the set tonight. 
um, in the showcase. I know Sam Rothstein is coming out. Um, shit. Let me see. I'm, let me go to my Facebook real quick. Because I'm literally so tired. I just... Uh, Okay, let me get out of here. See, I get distracted real easily. Like, I got uh, ADD or whatever. Some my distraction time is Freedom Messiah, Fizz Ed, Big Chief. Uh, come on now, pull it up, baby. Let me see you. Yeah, Jugga is there. Yeah, all right. So, I mean, you know what I'm saying? So, these are like, <laughs> these are some dope ass. <laughs> ah! <laughs> This, this is going to be really dope. Um, I they, You know, honestly, I have... There are other artists in this city that I've been following that I really like. I like Cash's Keys. You know what I'm saying? Like, I see you, baby. You are phenomenal. You're phenomenal. Like, and it's just... It's really cool. I really like that. I like that shit. I like what you do. I like what... I like what my guys do, you know? Like, it's so dope. Music is so dope. It's like the only reason why I'm here. Like, shit. I would have been slipped my wrist. Life is unbearable without music. Don't judge me. I'm just keeping it 100 with you. Like, life can be unbearable without this music game. Like, you have to, you have to be passionate about something. You have to love something in your life. And aside from my family and my friends, like, I love music. Like, I love music. I love traveling. You know, I love changing my hair up. <laughs> um, I like, I mean, you know what I'm saying? But music really has pulled me through some of the darkest times. Like, music has pulled me through. Just being able to write about stuff. Just being able to get it off your chest. And just seeing how beautifully it's just illustrated. And it's dope. Like, it's so dope. I'm a wordsmith. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm a wordsmith. I got catchy, catchy hooks. and I know how to write songs. Like, a lot of lyricists aren't really fail because they don't know how to write songs. Like, I'm a songwriter. Like, I know how to write. Like, I'm blessed. I'm completely blessed. And I'm blessed because, first of all, it's a God-given talent, you know, being able to speak, being able to have that charisma, being able to just be talented and weird. But then I'm also blessed because of the people that I've had in my life who I admire. And like people who are in my life just with their projects, their their discographies. Like like Lauren Hill, like, you know what I'm saying? She played such a major part in my life as a kid, like in my upbringing. Like Lauren was major for me. But anyway, I'm about to get off of here, you know, smoke this sugar red. You feel me? Come out to the show tonight. I hope to see y'all there. I love y'all.